He's the father of reality TV, Jonathan Murray. Emmy winner and creator of TV's most groundbreaking shows, The Real World, Project Runway, Keeping Up with the Kardashians, and now a and breakout docu-reality series, Born This Way. Born This Way is a show about seven young adults who have Down syndrome. Their parents have set high expectations for them, and they're thriving. Hey, boys. Gentlemen. Damn, I'm good. Uh, that's Carnegie. Hey, Megan. Hey, Megan. Hey, Megan. Hey, Megan. Hey, Megan. Now in its second season and nominated for three Emmy Awards, Born This Way is redefining reality TV. We really, in thinking about the show, we really wanted to focus on the ability within the disability. These young people are defying expectations every which way. And they're really showing us and reminding us that every, every individual has something to contribute. My paycheck. Way to start the day. Being independent is working on our own. Hey, Kevin. With Born This Way, I think the feeling was Here's another group of people that haven't really been featured on television. Oh, every once in a while you'll get someone, but we haven't really explored these issues. I tried to ask you not... the question, why you don't want to date with some of the girls who without a death syndrome? It's just how I look at things, how I actually react to people. And it's, it's, just, a, it's just really cool, it's the first it's the first television series with a predominantly disabled cast that's been nominated for an Emmy Award. With Murray helping to lead the charge, Hollywood is now recognizing the full power of diversity. I think Hollywood has been really, really slow to recognize the diversity of this country. Um, I think it's catching up fast now, um, and I think it's realizing that uh, diversity is good business. I don't think it's necessarily because it's altruistic. I think they're realizing that um, TV shows will do better if they reflect what the country is. What I would like to see is that more shows have a diversity to them where the diversity isn't the point of the show. I'd like to get beyond the labels to just accurately reflect what's going on in our country today. We're not there yet. We still have a ways to go.